The R-7 family of rockets Russian, R -7, is a series of rockets, derived from the Soviet R-7 Semyorka, the world's first ICBM. More R-7 rockets have been launched than any other family of large rockets. When Soviet nuclear warheads became lighter, the R-7 turned out to be impractical as a ballistic missile. It was not necessary to launch such heavy payloads in a military application. The rockets became useful in the Soviet, and later, Russian space programs with long-term development. Their purpose shifted primarily to launching satellites, probes, manned and unmanned spacecraft, and other non-threatening payloads. The R-7 family consists of both missiles and orbital carrier rockets. Derivatives include the Vostok, Voskhod and Soyuz rockets, which as of 2017 have been used for all Soviet, and later Russian manned spaceflights. The type has a unique configuration where four breakaway liquid-fueled engines surround a central core. The core acts as, in effect, a second stage» after the other four engines are jettisoned. These rockets are expendable. Later modifications were standardized around the Soyuz design. The Soyuz FG and Soyuz 2 are currently in use. The official Russian press announced that the Soyuz FG is to be retired by 2019 or 2020 in favor of the Soyuz 2-1A. R-7 rockets are launched from the Baikonur Cosmodrome, Plesetsk Cosmodrome, Guiana Space Center since 2011, see Soyuz at the Guiana Space Center, and the Vostokny Cosmodrome first launched 2016. After the R-7, Soyuz U and the Thor and Delta rocket families, the Cosmos launch vehicle, the best known of which is the Cosmos 3M, holds the third place record for number of successful orbital launch attempts, that is, of placing a satellite in orbit. <laughs> <laughs> Summary of variants All the R-7 family rockets are listed here by date of introduction. Most of the early R-7 variants have been retired. Active versions are shown in green. Korolev <coughs> <coughs> Cross The Korolev Cross is a visual phenomenon observed in the smoke plumes of the R-7 series rockets during separation of the four liquid-fueled booster rockets attached to the core stage. As the boosters fall away from the rocket, they pitch over symmetrically due to aerodynamic forces acting upon them, forming a cross-like shape behind the rocket. The effect is named after Sergei Korolev, the designer of the R-7 rocket. When the rocket is launched into clear skies, the effect can be seen from the ground at the launch site. See also 1957 in spaceflight List of R-7 launches Comparison of orbital launches families <laughs>